Welcome to The Daily Dish, I'm Say Pasta. Today in Shino's style, achieving a classic look. Okay, think about the style icons and notice one thing they all have in common. That's right, beautiful eyelashes. Well, if you weren't born with it, you can still get the look and we've got several ways to make it happen. First up, makeup. Technology these days is amazing. Mascara is taking our lashes to new heights and volume. Whether it's L'Oreal, Maybelline, or Revlon, all of them have lines that promise long and lush lashes. We like Double Extend and Colossal. The tube technology actually extends your lashes and the pulsating or oscillating brushes, whatever they are, not only do they add a little novelty to the process, they make some great looking lashes. Now to get Marilyn's look, you'll need some falsies, but don't let it intimidate you. A makeup artist gave me a little trick that works beautifully. Just cut the lashes in half. Use the smaller section just in the corner outside edges of your eyes. Then camouflage the glue with a little eyeliner and put on some mascara and you'll look gorgeous. Now probably the priciest solution, but maybe the most effective is doctor prescribed Latisse. We had a chance to visit with a doctor. Check it out. What the product is, is actually a um, glaucoma medication that's been used for many years. And the way it was discovered that it grows uh, great eyelashes is that glaucoma patients would put a drop in their eye, you know, every night and maybe a few months into it, long lashes on one side and not the other. We've been using it now since February. There's not a single patient who said it didn't work. This is Tina, and Tina has been using it for how long? Uh, about three months. About three months she's been using it, and um, those are outstanding eyelashes. So this is the way it comes. It's a prescription. It must be written by a physician, someone who is legally permitted. Once a day, get out your little brushes. You have two brushes. One is for each eye. And then just one little drop. And I'm just going to apply it just like you would an eyeliner. That's it. Now normally, you're doing this at the end of the day before you go to bed and you're not going to have makeup on. There's a very, very rare side effect that has been seen when it's been used in glaucoma and that is darkening of the iris. So if someone has very light blue eyes in about 3%, perhaps less of the glaucoma patients after using it for many months may see their eyes starting to darken. That's not been reported with it, and it shouldn't be getting in the eye. So if you accidentally get it in the eye, there's no cause for concern. So whatever method you choose, you can get that classic look, which by the way, we have wanted since 1913. That is when a chemist named T.L. Williams mixed coal dust and Vaseline, that's right, Vaseline petroleum jelly for his sister Mabel. Soon enough, the product caught on and became a success and turned into Maybelline. Who knew? Of course, you can get more great style ideas right here on the Shino Style Channel. Thanks for joining us today. I'm Shay Pasta. I'll see you back here tomorrow. Today's Daily Dish was brought to you by Caesars Bistro. Now every dog wants to be a Caesar dog. And be sure to enter the Shino's Pet Photo Contest. You and your pet could win up to $1,500 in cash. Thanks for watching Shino's TV. Look for more of The Daily Dish at SheKnows.com.